race prediction? Uh, 53-5. 53-5? Kirk Porter? 55-2. My, my, uh, Wait, my did you say 55? Dude, I haven't ran in two oh, weeks. Oh yeah, you haven't run in two weeks. 15 minutes out. I'm ready. Locked in. Definitely didn't just start dying after my warm up. We're good. <laughs> Brady Wallman, Brady Wallman. Ready to go. Ready to run fast. Good start, good finish. That's all we need. I'm Kirk. This is me before my race. Um, nerves have kicked in. I'm scared. <laughs> Some light. <laughs> First stops. Too easy. <laughs> Got cut off. So you're saying if you didn't get cut off, you would have run a 52, 53? 53. All righty, now time for Brady. Go Brady! Brady. Brady. Oh, boys, there you go Brady! All right, second girls race is about to start. Then we have one boys race, and then I race. So, Colin Craven over there, he's in the first mile race, and then I'm running the second one. Honestly, I don't have much speed work in me, so we're just gonna go out fast. And if I die, I die. But, lucky 13. So we'll see where it goes. The sun is so bright. Bro, why are you calling the camera like that, bro? <laughs> I'm tough at the camera. Totally baby. Mm. What's our thoughts after that race, Kurt? Slow. I could have ran two seconds faster. Are we going to talk about how we finished the race? <laughs> exactly. I could have ran two seconds faster. What about the look back in the race? It was, it was like a, you know, it was just like a, just to make sure. And then I was like, my job. Oh yeah, Mercer already going backwards. Let him cook. As long as he beats that freshman. Bro, he ain't got loose to a freshman, bro. Lock it, you know. like victory, bro. Lock it, or not, he got it. He got it. Actually, freshman. Liam moving up, though, big time. Go, oh, Liam, right there, Liam, right there, Liam. Put this camera on the over. Bro, you didn't even act like you ran for her, bro. Because it was easy. I think it's kind of tough, bro. To him. Hey, Liam, stay in this group. Stay in this group. Where's Graham Hatter at? I don't know. Good job, Liam. Good job. Keep it going. Good job. Good smart race. There you go, bud. Come on, fight through it. Bro, get the race. What? Bro, I can't see from over there. Hey, Liam, stay in this group. Stay in this group, Liam. Stay in it. Everybody run that guy. Oh, so bad. Hey, Liam, stay in it, Liam. Gotta make it hurt now. Stay in it, Liam. Come on, kick, Liam. Kick. How are we feeling? Four, 40 something. Yeah. I think it was 50. 51. Some light, a little red. Throat's hurting. A little bit. <laughs> Jesus, the past kids. Why didn't you stick with them? I just didn't have it. <laughs> Hello. <clears throat> so I had my first meet of the year yesterday at College of St. Mary's. It's called their Metro Indoor, the Prelim Series or something. I don't remember the name for sure. But it's probably good that it was inside because if you're aware of the time where this video is taking place, the wind chill has been anywhere between negative 20 and negative 40 for the past few days, which is not too fun to run in. So it's a good thing that it was indoors. I did not know what to expect going into this meet, seeing as I hadn't run in a couple days due to the cold. We couldn't even really get outside of our house, so I couldn't 
go to the Y or something and run the treadmill because there was seven inches of snow everywhere. I hadn't really done any speed work since the 25 miles. I had done maybe one speed work workout. So I had no clue what my speed and fitness was like either. So I ran a 451. My first 800 was a 219. My second 800 was a 232. I'm happy with that race. I'm happy with that result because this is my third year doing the CSM indoor meets. My debut, I guess you could call it my preseason debut, my freshman and sophomore years was a 504 and a 501 mile respectively. So I really encouraged to see that I ran a 451. I felt surprisingly good through the first 800. As you might have seen in the video, I had contact with the people I was wanting to trail through that. And then that second 800, my fitness started to show and my body started to realize, hey, you have no speed work in you. You are not ready for this. Then I started to die out. But the first 800, I was feeling pretty good. I'm very encouraged by my results today. I'm excited for the next Metro Indoors meet, which will be January 28th. Next Metro Indoor meet with January 28th. So I'm going to do the mile again that week and I'm hoping to break into the 440s again. And then the last Metro Indoors meet will be mid-February, and I'm hoping to get back in the 430s. My PR is a 436. I don't know what's feasible, what's not, but if I can get into, into the mid to low 440s by the third indoor meet before track season starts, I'll be very, very happy. But I'm excited. This was a good meet, and we're going to keep this rolling. Thanks for tuning in. And I'll see you all next time.